Hey everyone, this is Code Have Ox. In this video, I'll show you how to download and run the unrestricted AI models using Olama on your Windows PC. Similar process is applied for other operating systems as well. Let's get started. This video is for educational purposes only and is intended to guide users on installing and running unrestricted AI models locally. I do not endorse or encourage any misuse, unethical applications, or violations of legal and ethical guidelines. Viewers are solely responsible for how they choose to use AI technology and should ensure compliance with all applicable laws and terms of service. First, we're going to go to Alama's official site and download the Alama application. Make sure to install the version that matches your operating system. Once the installation is complete, we need to verify that Alama is installed correctly. To do this, open PowerShell and type Alama dash dash version. If everything is set up properly, you should see the version number displayed. Now that Alama is installed and verified, we are going to run the Wizard Vicuna Uncensored 7B model. You can check out other unrestricted models as well, such as Llama 2 Uncensored and Dolphin Mixtral. Now open PowerShell and type Alama, run Wizard Vicuna Uncensored 7B. This command will begin downloading the model and the time it takes will depend on your internet speed. Once the download finishes, the model will automatically start running, and you can begin interacting with it by asking questions. Before running this model, it's important to mention the requirements. To run Wizard Vicuna Uncensored 7B smoothly, you should have a system with at least 16 gigabytes of RAM, a capable GPU, such as an RTX 2060 or higher, and sufficient disk space to accommodate the model's files. Now that we have the model running in the terminal, let's take it a step further by hosting it on a web interface similar to ChatGPT. For this, we will install OpenWebUI. OpenWebUI provides an easy-to-use interface for interacting with AI models locally. Once installed and set up, you'll be able to access the model through your browser just like ChatGPT, making it even more user-friendly. So now that we already have both Alama and the model installed, just install Docker Desktop for WSL, and once installed, go to Settings, Resources, WSL Integration, and enable your installed Windows Linux system. For my case, it's Ubuntu. Now that is done, navigate to your WSL terminal, and on the OpenWeb UI GitHub page, you have the options, such as, if Olama is on your computer, use this command, or if Olama is on a different server, Use this command and many more. And after copying the command as to your requirements, paste it in the terminal and hit enter. It should then begin the installation of OpenWeb UI with the help of Docker Desktop. Now wait, and then, when the installation is finished, it should now appear on the Docker Desktop. Just go to your browser and then type localhost with port 3000. Now create a new account by signing up. Remember to store your credentials so that you don't have trouble signing in back again. Once that is done, we should now be into our web panel. You can now access the installed uncensored local Alama models over here and chat with it to test. And that's it. You've successfully installed and run unrestricted AI locally on Windows. And now you can access it through a web-based UI. If you found this helpful, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe. See you in the next one. This is Code Havox, signing out.